Hello Rebels, Obi here with another Grounded video. The trailer for Shroom and Doom has just dropped. I want to break it down. I'm super excited for the stuff we've just seen. So let's watch the trailer first and then we'll get into it. In the first year of Grounded, Millions of players kept busy with crafting, fighting, the bond, zip lining, flying things. Now, to celebrate, we present the Shroom and Doom update. It gives the people what they've been asking for, like sitting. No, seriously, a lot of people want to sit. Pets for when you get sick of your human companions. And of course, mushrooms. But not those kinds. We've also got something that literally no one was asking for. The brood mother. She's so terrifying. You should probably turn on arachnophobia mode. Oh, even her blob scares the sh out of us. Go big. Or never go home. Oh, and it looks like we added achievements too. Nice. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed that trailer as much as I am. Uh, let's take a look at some of the awesome, incredible things we've just seen. So, first thing we're going to look at is uh, the birthday scene. Uh, so, we've got these, what it looks like, they've put candles around an Oreo cake. Obviously, this is to celebrate the birthday, and I don't think you're going to have this kind of Oreo cake in the game. But, it's good to feed. So, we've got these uh, pillars, which we know about. They did say in the uh, in the note when they were talking about the update. So, we know these are in the game. And what's interesting to me is this bit. These look like either nuts. Like, they're adding some kind of nuts in there. Or, this could be the pupa. The pupa we know, uh, we've seen in the game. Um, I showed it off on my last Grounded video. Uh, I'll put a link up, on, uh, up top. But, this could be pupa. Uh, or pupa hide that's coming into the game um, there at the end of June. We have seen that in the game. Kind of looks like this. Or it looks like this. So I don't know. Maybe. Maybe it is these. Or maybe they're just some kind of nuts. Or maybe they're not even going to add them in the game. But at this point, we don't know. But it's interesting to see. All right. So next, we see new armor. Now look at this, like centurion looking armor. It looks metallic. This could be used in the pupa hide. It looks the same color. It's kind of shiny. It's got like acorn pieces maybe attached in there. Don't Maybe that's going <laughs> to... I don't know if this is going to use the acorn um, food pieces. I don't know. It looks cool. Look at this hat here we've got. And we've got these new shorts. We've got the shield. That looks like black ant armor. Uh, I'm pretty certain that's black ant armor right there. Uh, you see the helmet, it's not red anymore, but it is the ant. Maybe that shield comes from the black ant, maybe. So that's definitely black ant armor. The B the B one looks the same. Kind of mixed up. This crossbow, which we've seen in the game, or uh, like we can see it is a crossbow made of crow feathers. Which is just yeah, I, I'm excited. I'm a bow guy, as you all know. If you see me playing bows crossbows and that coming in is just going to be great right here we've got I, I, what i can i'm i'm imagining and i'm pretty certain on this this is the grinder uh we know there's a grinder coming and uh according to the um the description to it it creates a lot of noise um which is going to um either attract or scare away insects it just says they don't like it, which is fantastic. Now you can see, uh, it's definitely the grinder, I would say, because like, you've got this uh, liquid pouring out of it. And we know the grinder, you put something in it, uh, like um, the acid glands would go into it, and it's going to pour out antacid. So behind this, you can see there's actually a kiln. 
which is super exciting because we've seen in game there's an ever burning charcoal chunk and i'm assuming we we are going to be we're going to be breaking stuff down we're going to be burning it we're going to be making stuff we know that this grinder we know there's resins in there uh, that we have to mix to make hardened sprigs and things like that so this is so exciting there's so many so much new ways of going to be building and increasing stuff is yeah super exciting <laughs> i'm so excited for this so again in this scene you see the uh, centaurian o armor again kind of thing uh, it could be black ant it could be black ant it could be the pupa i'm gonna say more pupa than the black ant but i could be wrong i mean that shield them as well so next we see these buoyancy lights flags markers i know we already have water markers in there i don't think they have lights on them i could be completely wrong buoyancy thingy whether that is that light or this is something different so yeah we get into the scene we actually see tiny p actually sitting on the chair which yes we have been asking for uh, for a long long time it's super exciting i'm so happy i'm sure they're happy to be finally releasing it because the uh, it does get asked a lot uh, so that's exciting next we've got aphid taming finally and i talked about this in the last video oh, i think so what's gonna happen as you see this compass so yeah as uh as i explained in the last video we got these mushroom bricks and mushroom slurry now the mushroom slurry interestingly it says in the top corner bug treat now to me that's a treat maybe we're going to be feeding our aphids to tame these bug treats and that's how we tame aphids maybe so next up we have the cutting down of the mushroom for the new mushroom bricks and slurry and that what i'm interested to see is she's using a level two axe we have seen in the game an axe free so whether that's for the pupa and we get to chop these down with just our normal level two axes we shall see but yeah so that's definitely unless he's got the same model but that's definitely she's chopping that down with and of course, mushrooms. a normal thing and that's a normal two ammo and then we see this these amazing looking brick walls now what you can see if you just scroll back a little bit there we go so what you do see is you see the mushroom bricks and things like that that look incredible. Uh, we know they've already announced that they can have stairs that you can flip. So the spiral stairs can go both ways and things like that. Uh, you can also note this new door and these archways as well. Like these little archway kind of hobbit doors uh, that you've got here, which look incredible. Um, looks like it uses uh, the acorn um, species. So that's going to be interesting to see. Growing mushrooms. It looks like we can grow these kind of mushrooms. It's definitely interesting to see that we might be able to grow these mushrooms for the bricks. Because there isn't too many of these type of mushrooms around in the world. I thought they were either going to be these or the brown mushrooms that you do see in near the oak tree lab. Because there is some brown ones there. And obviously you got the ones up on the oak tree. But yeah, it looks like it's just this one so far that we've seen. Uh, and then we get to the really creepy, scary, just this, the, what the, this just, just, oh, just, uh, <laughs> and just, like, the model is completely changed, because if uh, anybody uh, played uh, this game before, the old brood mother kind of just looked like a bigger version of the orb weaver and wasn't that much stronger now she looks like she's got some kind of crazy looking armor plating back just looks menacing and horrible and it just creeps me out looking at that but i'm excited i'm really excited for that that looks so so good Rude mother's back. Interestingly, she's not on top of the frisbee. She's inside some kind of cave in this. So whether the edge is going to change a little bit? I'm not entirely sure where that tunnel's going to be in the head section. They move it. Maybe, well, I mean, he's not wearing a mask. It looks like he's wearing black ant armor again. Or the pupa armor. And he's he's not wearing a mask. So I wouldn't say it's in the haze zone. Because we know there's going to be a haze update potentially. So next up. Next up is basketball 
finally we get the basketball thing which we have seen in the game again it, at the moment it just looks like a little pebble um but yeah we're finally going to get our actual basketball to throw in the hoop which is just awesome i'm so excited for that we can finally play basketball uh properly this next part got me interest because i can't quite tell what's going on like we got this crazy explosion which looked like at first i thought oh they're in the gas zone this is where the gas zone are these are black ant these these are black ants on the screen right now they're not the normal red ants they are black ants. we've got this crazy explosion things going on i wasn't too sure about where where they were like i said i, I thought at first because these look like the you know the, the mutated ones but if you go through and pause it yeah so you know the the mutated mites explode and do their things like that and this scene so this scene again at first i thought well that looks because that looks like the porch in the background that does look like the porch in the background but obviously they haven't got gas masks on again so i would say maybe that's the sandbox and this is going to be the edge of the sandbox maybe this is going to be a new until entrance to the brood mother that they're going into right now he's got the crossbow again it, oh, looks, it looks like we amazing and no achievements nice. achievements for the game how freaking awesome is that i'm so excited this looks incredible it looks incredible i'm so excited um so yeah so let me know in the comments below let me know what you think let me know if i missed anything in the trailer seriously reach out with your ideas what you think is gonna happen if you enjoy this kind of video from me uh, let me know i can do more if you want i don't usually do this kind of stuff but i'm certainly happy to do more subscribe hit the like button hit the bell button do all the things thank you all watching stay grounded and may the force be with you